Hello friends, I am Vine from taxabdutal.com Introductions of Ionic Part 3 Inside this video, I will be show you header and footer component of the Ionic Framework In previous uh, video, we already uh, learned about how to install Ionic Framework and uh, what is the basic introductions and folder tr structures of the Ionic Framework So inside this video, I will be show you the header, footer and uh, we will be run our first applications inside this Ionic Framework So let's do it so in previous video I already download one folder and I just open this folder in my sublime sublime text text editor which is the best text editor for the programming language okay and all, all kind of the programming language you can do it this is the best and free and open source if you want to expand then it will be purchased but uh, uh, free is enough for us okay so in previous video we uh, in previous video we already understood about the directory structures inside the, and in this video I'll be show you the first applications and with how to integrate header and footer inside your first application. So inside open the www folder index.html which is a main file when you open your applications when you run your applications at the time index.html file will run will run first time. Okay, so this is the basic uh, pre-built setup for Ionic applications. So this is a meta tag and uh, height and width which will be set automatically of your device. And this is a link tag. It will uh, link of your CSS and uh, all kind of the CSS will be linked inside this tag. And script uh, Ionic bundle.js which is also included using this script tag and Cordova JS for the Cordova plugins and uh, uh, JS app dot JS basically a uh, angular file for uh, backend programming of your applications so uh, body ng app which is basically angular directory if you know the angular js then you easily understood what is ng app which is one kind of the directory it implies that uh, you starting your applications from this tag okay so i will be learn uh, basic concept of angular js inside this video tutorial uh, so don't worry if you don't know and uh, ionic pen is basically a panel when you op let's start first of all run this applications and then i will be show you uh, which tag which is used specifically for the particular element so right inside this node command prompt open our now node server for running these applications in our browser so d drive cd ionic and my current directory folder that is first tab first tab okay right now i am my current directory right now i want to run this application so this is a basically command for ionic so and press enter it will be automatically run your application in your browser and if you want to change this anything it will be automatically reflect so you don't need to refresh your applications for uh, changes after changes so it will be start server since will be run inside this localhost 8100 port so we just go through this localhost and 800 so our applications run for so ionic started which is basically a blank template so no need to any any basic component so we need to add inside this template Okay, so first of all we uh, go through ionic official website this is the ionic official website you will get all kind of the stuff if you want to uh, get from the ionic so it will be available inside this website so inside the doc tab there is a uh, certain component like javascript components our you and books and all this reference of understanding of the ionic framework already placed inside this website so go through the css component because we will learn this component inside this video series and then after javascript component so first of all the header you can see a uh, different type of, of colors available at here if you place bar as a royal M, balance and claim positive these are the eight i think nine color which is provide ionic by default if you want to develop and design application among this and uh, of this color so you usually usually use this class bar as a two bar royal if you want to uh, color is a red then you can use bar as a two it will be show you let's uh, do it practically okay so inside your code window and one more thing that ionic provided live reloading if you change something at here and just save it it will be automatically reflect on the other end i will show you and uh, minimize this screen and this is our application live run 
on the browser this appropriate setting of our screen okay so it easily understood you how it work so now I change something at here I just uh, remove it and control s it automatically reload and start will be removed at here you can see it uh, live reload features automatically provided by the ionic framework okay so this is a basically a uh, startup module if you want to header and footer uh, header already placed inside the ion header bar class bar stable bar stable is basically a color as we already see inside this okay open in next browser docs and css component you can see bar table is one kind of the class which is give this kind of color antique white uh, light white white color if you want to red color of your background then just copy this class because this is a cl uh, color name and paste it here remove first of all because you want to write it and save it so it will be automatically flag and it will be in black color so you use any kind of this uh, color from among this nine color and uh, it will give you a uh, instant output of your changes so let in let's integrate footer of your applications first of all we understood the how it basically is structure ion pen is used for the panel of your applications and then after uh, ion header header basically gives a functionality to add header inside your applications so ion header bar basically one kind of the class already you can also use as a class as a uh, tag also okay so now ion content content is basically a content which is displayed inside there after the header and footer which is on between content which is of your applications logic main application interactions main design of your application will be inside this folder inside your inside this will be inside this layout content layout so now we integrate the footer of your application so inside the panel I just give one div and class ion footer if you go through the reference of and uh, now we integrate the footer so let's get the documentations and it here footer if you want to add this kind of this footer then you just copy this tag and paste it here and one more thing that you uh, consider and mention it here after the content you need to add your footer and save it so automatically you will get the reference and yeah it will be footer okay so this is your header this is your footer and between this content so let's integrate some of the things inside this content I want to uh, p tag hello this is line 1 it's a simple message which uh, which indicate this is first line and this is second line second okay and save it it will automatically display inside the between of applications so you can just scroll facility also provide inside your ionic framework so this is the first so uh, this is the layout of application of footer component develop ionic in the next uh, video i'll be showing you the footer which two component may use other component of the ionic framework cart layout and list and button and other components so i hope you will be like this video if you like then please comment if you have any questions any query and if you have stuck some steps so just a comment behind of the below of this video and thank you very much for watching this video have a nice day and please subscribe, don't forget to subscribe.